Hey folks, it's Mr. K with Mr. K's Mower Salvage. I'm here today to show you how to identify your mower and your engine. So I'm going to go ahead and flip the screen around here. Maybe. No. Alright, so this is a Craftsman riding lawnmower. As you can see here, the, the plate is always located under the seat. Um, should have the model number, this one, 917. Most craftsmen start off with a 917. Um, not all of them, though. Um, on your engines, this is your older style opposing twin engine. And you can see on this plate right here, you've got the model number, the type, and the code. The code is always important on these engines because they may change parts after uh, so long and uh, so it's just important to have that code the the part numbers for the crankshaft the piston could be different based on that code so always important to get that code as you can see here we got another craftsman mower and again 917 um, craftsman's pretty typical about that if you get into your cub cadets troy built mtds typically if you were to lift up the back seat and right on the seat plate, you would have the same tag. A lot of times starts off with a 1-3. Um, if you come across to John Deere, they're usually behind the left wheel on the frame, starting typically with a GX. Um, sometimes it'll be like a 1GX or MOL. And then um, show you one of these engines here. This is a Kohler Command V-Twin engine. There's usually a plate here on the side. You got the model number CV730 and then dash 0017 it looks like. Um, but anytime you're looking for your parts, you get those model numbers. Um, you can always Google search them and you'll come up with some of the, the uh, new retailers out there. There's E-Replacement. It's probably one of the better ones to look through. Um, but there's others. There's Jack Small Engine, um, Sears does a lot of the craftsman stuff john deere has their own website if you just type in uh deer parts it comes up it's john deere parts catalog and um it's always best if when looking for parts get that model number go on their website search it out see what the specific parts are for your mower um they're not always a one size fits all you can't just say i've got a craftsman um, LT1000 expect all the parts are always going to be the same they do vary uh, Craftsman's usually pretty good about it they don't change it up a great deal but you get into your John Deere's your MTD products and there's quite a variation so there you go that's identifying your uh, model number of your your mower and your uh, engine always important get those mower part numbers correct for your machine so you don't have to retrofit anything God bless you, and don't forget to cut your grass.